So, not really a doom and gloom kind of guy when it comes to anything, really. And, you know, gaming has been such a passion to me. And I've been blessed to be able to share my moments on YouTube. And just with my friends in general. Because gaming has been such a huge community for me personally. I mean... Growing up as a military brat, moving all over the place, living in the United States, joining the military myself, getting medically discharged, like, it was one way that I could continue to have friends, you know? To stay in touch with those people that I made deep connections with. And one of those games was Halo. I grew up with Halo from, you know, Halo 1, Combat Evolved, you know, Halo 2. I remember being 8 and being excited. So excited for Halo 2. I was like 8 or 7, right? I was born in 2000. I was so excited. I remember talking to my friends like, oh, what if we could play as different species? What if we could be saying Healy? We were excited, man. Like, that shit was... That shit was dope, right? You know, then it dropped and like, I played Halo 2 countless times, countless times. I'm, I'm not really one to do rants or anything. I'm not really like a huge person to spout out, but it's been a game that's got me through rough times, got me through rough patches and especially in the Halo Reach days and I don't know, just seeing the mismanagement with Microsoft to the title is just heartbreaking. You know, just like everybody else, I've been playing Helldivers 2. And it's been great. But playing Helldivers 2 has got me back playing Halo 2. Or not Halo 2, got me back playing Halo 3 ODST, right? And... You know, it's, it's a trip. So, you know, replaying the Halos this past weekend because I had an army buddy, really good friend, um, come over and, you know, we just had a little LAN party to ourselves, you know, playing Halo 2, ODST, you name it. And this franchise is just, you know, it's been it's 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 held a deep place right so i really wish i could get close and have the same connections as i did with halo i mean i got other games now too right like i run DD campaigns and me and my brother really close because i got him a pc in 2020 so we game all the time you know, I've created other communities like in Fallout 76 with Steel Defiance and a bunch of other things, but nothing hits closer home, staying up late and fighting the depression as a kid, you know, and all the things that's going on and just staying up late, you know. Either be it joining clans, doing clan raids, or, you know, becoming a part of a clan and taking it over slowly because it's just fun. I know, I was a little bit of a dickhead, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Like, we literally had this set group of people, right? Enough to fill at least a team for big team battle. And so, we'd slowly inject ourselves in these clans, and then sometimes we make a row, we do forge... Oh, dude, it was great. I remember playing late up night and just, like fighting you remember those you remember those inheritor squads so like, it was like this whole squad of people who were inheritors that would just like smash and kill and just try to destroy the competition on a uh, big team battle we're, we were inheritors and we went at odds with them all the time late at night and we beat them <laughs> dude we killed them so much i'm like ha that's what you get you got killed by a fucking you know, 15 year old kid who's only fucking what a field marshal or a hero like dude dude that shit was awesome you know Halo's such between 
all the custom games, late night making the maps, the clan raids, big team battle. I love big team battle. That is that is my go-to. Like it's, I'm, I'm happy to have the memories. I'm just sad that, and I and I know there's new, you know, newer generation that like the Halo games now. I'm not trying to discredit it or be a you know a, a doomer boomer saying like oh well back in my day halo was great you know halo can be great to anybody and you know and the other you know in different kind of special ways and i hope people have that connection i really do i just i don't know between all the trend chasing and the down spiral since four like, I just... It's sad. It's a sad part of me that... And I know it's, you know, a lot of nostalgia. And I know a lot of you feel the same, too. I, hell, I don't even know how many people are going to watch this, but... I miss those times. And, you know, I'm pretty happy relatively late. You know, I got good things going for me, but... Nothing beats. I had a buddy AJ. We would, <laughs> yeah. He he told me a joke once. I tell it to all my friends. They're sick and tired of hearing it. So the best. I was really depressed. Right. I I couldn't sleep. I don't remember what time of the month it was. If I had off or it was just a weekend. But you know, because I was going through some rough times at home, and I see he left a voicemail. And he told me a joke, and then afterwards, I'll, I'll tell the joke quick. So he was like, what do you call a belt made out of a watch? And he pauses, and he goes, a wasted time. And that was like the best joke. And I met this man through Terraria originally, but we played Halo Reach so fucking much. Halo Reach, Halo ODST, like you name it, we played it so much. And you know, at times, I mean, I still have his number. We talk text occasionally, but you know, it's the friendships like that, right? And yeah, after that, we got on ODST and we played Legendary and beat it in one night, man. It was great. And we've done that with other games like Halo Wars. Oh, I love Halo Wars. Me and my buddies have recently, you know. It was on sale on Steam for like five bucks and we just got back into it because that one's iconic too. It's an RTS, but it's Halo. And that team that worked on it, because Bungie didn't work on it. And that's what I'm... They tried so hard to keep the idea Bungie had and just continue that legacy. And, you know, I know some people nitpick about the story, but to me, that was awesome. That game was really a treasure personally and yeah I I guess that's my little rant going down memory lane you know cuz just lately with hell divers and everything people are just upset with Halo everybody's disappointed to a degree And I, I just wish, I just wish every Halo fan could get closure. I don't know. Maybe you have, maybe I'm just spouting out into the dark, you know, dust and echoes. But we made it this far. Thank you for listening. I hope you have some great gaming times in your life. Find new communities, find new friends. Because, I mean, it's more than just a game. As, you know, as, you know, basic as that sounds, it, it just is.
For us, the storm has passed. The war is over. But let us never forget those who journeyed into the howling dark and did not return. For their decision required courage beyond measure. Sacrifice and unshakable conviction that their fight, our fight, was elsewhere. As we start to rebuild, this hillside will remain barren, a memorial to heroes fought. They ennobled all of us, and they shall not be forgotten. started, what your kind did to mine. I can't forgive you, but you have my thanks for standing by him to the end. Hard to believe he's dead. Were it so easy. look different without the Prophet's lies, Cloudy I would like to see you alone, to know that it is safe. Fear not, for we have made it safe. By your word, Cloudy Take us home. <laughs> <laughs> 